Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back. So as you can see, we are doing a complete fire everything you need to know guide on the cargo drones. Now basically I've got a bunch of footage already. I wanted to do a little guide on these, but I was waiting for these keys to release. There was a timer on the doors and now they're here. We've got all the information we've need. I've got the guide ready for you. So let's get straight on with this video. Starting off with the basics, cargo drones basically spawn in nearly every single location around the map. And they have a set circle that they just fly around continuously until someone shoots them down. You get them in blue, purple and gold, that's what they switch between. You don't get common, but don't bother trying to shoot the ball in midair. I would 100% advise hitting the drone, because sometimes the loot just spreads out really wide and you can you might end up losing the important stuff. When you do go to shoot it, if you shoot it and don't, drop the ball it will just fly off really fast for about 50 meters before continuing its uh, normal pace so be make sure you take it down quick now as you can see a really random useless and kind of funny tip you can actually push these cargo like crates around like a football i'm not sure if that might be something that comes into play later but be careful with the drone when it hits the floor and explodes it can severely damage you if you're right on top of it it can do over 100 damage and that can kill you if you haven't got shield be careful now i've got a theory right now look at the ball and there's a specific circle that's got gold triangles around it there's that it's only that one little like lit up area that is highlighted with the gold triangles now as you can see here i swear sometimes a lot of the times it gives me attachments and loot that i can use so for instance right here i swear it's given me attachments and equipment that i could use or could put on my guns again here it's not giving me a heavy extended mag or barrel mods it's uh, like a shotgun barrel but it's given me everything i could put on my guns if I didn't already have them. It's just a theory. Let me know in the comments if you figured anything out with that special little spot. But we've also got these new key drones. This is the final part of the video. We finally got these. And you can tell these by these little red glowing sections on them. You'll see them if it's blue, purple, and gold. And that also means it doesn't matter if you shoot it down when it's blue at the very lowest. You're still going to get that key. You can just guarantee it by seeing the drone and seeing those red circles. Um, as you can see here, I'm shooting a purple and I still get it. Now, point to note. It takes up an inventory slot. So if you're intending to do a snatch and grab, make sure you've already emptied an inventory slot beforehand because otherwise you'll be sitting there trying to mess around, drop stuff, switch things, and yeah, it can be a bit annoying. And as you can see, when you pick it up, it shows the rooms that are still locked on the map, which is pretty cool. So you can just go straight to them and it also shows where all of them are. So now we're actually at the loot room it, yep, you just gotta open it up like normal using our brand new vault key. It takes three seconds to open, but it also takes around a two second animation time for the doors to open. So it's around five seconds in total, and you can't close the doors once they're open. They're stuck like that for the rest of the game. Now, loot-wise, as you can see, you've got four on the left, there'll be four on the right, and then there'll be two at the front. So there's a total of 10 floor loot spots. And you do get things like body armor and stuff. I just didn't happen to get it this time. And uh, yeah, we've finally got access to these. And Respawn have intended for us to make some plays here. I'm going to make a video on that, as I said, later for a certain reason. And obviously, you know me. I straight away had to try and find a hiding spot in this room. And this was probably the best I could find. But I found one anyway. But other than that, that's been my cargo drone guide. That's going to be everything you need to know. Um, I'll do a little update if we end up figuring some new little secret out or something. But other than that, like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell, especially. You know the drill and I'll catch you all later. Peace.